Antarctica, the final frontier on Earth, a vast icy wilderness teeming with unexplored mysteries. Nestled at the southernmost tip of our world, Antarctica is a land of extremes. This icy expanse, larger than Europe and Australia combined, is the coldest, windiest and driest continent. Its harsh conditions and remote location have preserved its secrets, locked away under layers of ice, untouched and unspoiled. Imagine a place so cold that the very air you breathe freezes. A place so remote that the nearest human settlement is over a thousand miles away. That is Antarctica. An inhospitable land it may seem, yet this has not deterred the brave and the curious. Explorers, scientists, adventurers, they have all been drawn to this icy wilderness, drawn by the allure of the unknown, by the promise of discovery. In this icy desert, surrounded by the unforgiving Antarctic Ocean, these intrepid souls dare to venture. They embark on journeys of exploration and discovery, braving the cold, the isolation, the dangers, all in the pursuit of knowledge. They seek to uncover the truths hidden beneath the ice, truths that have the potential to rewrite our understanding of history, of science, of life itself. The isolation of Antarctica has not deterred those who seek to uncover its hidden. Instead, it has only fueled their curiosity, their determination, their resolve. They brave the ice and snow, the freezing temperatures, the deadly storms, all for the chance to explore the unexplored, to discover the undiscovered, to unlock the secrets of the final frontier on Earth. Antarctica, a land of mystery and wonder, continues to beckon those willing to venture into its icy embrace. And who knows what secrets they may uncover, what truths they may reveal, what mysteries they may solve. We are only just beginning to scratch the surface of this vast icy wilderness. The real exploration of Antarctica has only just begun. Stay with us as we continue to unravel the mysteries of our world. Subscribe to our channel for more exhilarating content like this. One of the most enigmatic puzzles is the Piri Race Map, an ancient chart that challenges our understanding of history. This map, created in the early 16th century by Ottoman admiral and cartographer Piri Race, is a testament to the advanced geographical knowledge of its time. But what makes this map truly remarkable is its depiction of the Antarctic coastline, a region not officially discovered until the early 19th century. Now let's take a moment, let that sink in. Here we have a map, crafted over 300 years before Antarctica was officially found, showcasing a detailed illustration of the continent's coastline. This feat is so extraordinary that it raises a series of questions about the capabilities of ancient navigators and the potential existence of a prehistoric civilization with advanced geographical knowledge. The Piri race map wasn't created in a vacuum. It's believed to be based on a collection of older source maps, some of which might date back to the time of Alexander the Great or even earlier. If this is true, the implications are significant. It suggests that ancient civilizations had the ability to navigate the high seas with precision and had knowledge of the world that was far more comprehensive than we've given them credit for. This brings us to Antarctica. The depiction of this ice-covered continent, the map is surprisingly accurate. But here's the kicker. The Piri race map shows Antarctica as ice-free, with a topography that matches seismic surveys of the landmass beneath the current ice cap. This begs the question, how could an ancient civilization have known about this? This leads us down a rabbit hole of possibilities. Could there have been a prehistoric civilization with advanced seafaring and cartography skills? Did they explore the world extensively, discovering Antarctica before it was enveloped in ice? Or perhaps does this indicate the existence of a lost civilization that once thrived on a temperate Antarctic continent? The existence of the Piri race map is a cartographic enigma that challenges our understanding of human history. It's a tangible piece of evidence that suggests our ancestors may have been far more advanced and globally connected than we ever imagined. It's a testament to the potential of human achievement and a reminder that the history we know might not be as linear or as straightforward as we think. The existence of the Piri race map suggests that history as we know it might need a revision. As we continue to unravel the mysteries of Antarctica, we must be prepared to question what we think we know and be open to new possibilities. For in the world of cartography, as in life, the only constant is change. And as we navigate this journey of discovery together, remember to like this video, subscribe to our channel and stay tuned for more intriguing revelations. Adding to the enigma of Antarctica is the discovery of meteorite ALH 84001 a celestial object that may hold the secrets of life beyond Earth. 
In the icy expanse of Antarctica, scientists stumbled upon a truly cosmic mystery, a meteorite named ALH84001. This isn't just any space rock, it's a piece of the red planet itself, Mars. Its discovery on Earth, millions of miles away from its home, raises intriguing questions about the nature of our universe and the extent of life within it. What makes ALH84001 so fascinating isn't just its Martian origin. Within this meteorite, scientists found structures that could potentially turn our understanding of life on its head. These structures, tiny and intricate, have been interpreted by some in the scientific community as fossilized microbial life. Yes, you heard that right, possible fossils from an alien life form. Imagine for a moment the implications of this. If these structures are indeed remnants of Martian microbes, it would mean that life once existed on Mars. It would suggest that life, in its most basic form, can survive the harsh conditions of space travel, encased within a meteorite. This opens up the possibility that life on Earth could have originated from elsewhere in the universe. This theory, known as panspermia, proposes that life is not exclusive to Earth. Instead, it suggests that the seeds of life are scattered throughout the cosmos, hitching a ride on meteorites and comets, waiting for the right conditions to take root and flourish. However, it's essential to remember that not all scientists agree on the interpretation of these structures. Some argue they could be the result of non-biological processes. The debate is ongoing, and more research is needed to reach a definitive conclusion. But whether or not these structures prove to be fossilized life, the discovery of ALH84001 has already expanded our understanding of the universe and our place within it. It reminds us that life is resilient and adaptable, capable of surviving in the most extreme environments. It encourages us to continue exploring, to continue questioning, and to continue pushing the boundaries of our knowledge. If these structures are indeed fossilized life, it would suggest that the seeds of life are spread throughout the universe. Recent findings in Antarctica hint at even more astonishing possibilities concealed beneath the ice. As we continue our journey into the enigmatic heart of Antarctica, we find ourselves faced with a slew of recent discoveries that have the potential to turn our understanding of history on its head. These discoveries, some of which have been brought to light by public figures such as Joe Rogan, include ancient maps and artifacts that seem to suggest the existence of previously unknown civilizations and technologies. Imagine if you will standing on the vast, icy expanse of the Antarctic plains and uncovering a map that predates any known civilization. A map that not only depicts the world with a level of detail and accuracy that rivals our modern satellite imagery, but also includes regions that, according to mainstream history, should not have been discovered at the time of its creation. This is not the stuff of science fiction, but a reality that we are beginning to grapple with. In addition to maps, artifacts of unknown origin and purpose have been unearthed. These objects made from materials and techniques that we struggle to replicate today, suggest a level of technological sophistication that seems out of place in our current timeline of human history. It's as if we've stumbled upon a hidden chapter of our past, one that tells a story of ancient cultures that were far more advanced and globally connected than we've ever imagined. But what does this all mean? How do we reconcile these discoveries with our existing understanding of history? The implications are far-reaching. For one, they challenge the idea that human progress has been a linear journey from primitive to advanced. Instead, they suggest a cyclical or even fragmented pattern of development, with periods of advanced civilization possibly existing in our distant past. Furthermore, these findings point towards a level of global connectivity among ancient cultures that far exceeds what we've previously thought. The presence of similar architectural structures, symbols, and technologies across different continents suggests a level of interaction and exchange of ideas that we've only associated with our modern era. Perhaps most excitingly, these discoveries open up the possibility of ancient technologies waiting to be rediscovered. Technologies that could provide solutions to challenges we face today, from energy production to sustainable living. These discoveries could revolutionize our understanding of human history. We stand on the precipice of a new era of discovery, one that could fundamentally alter our perception of ourselves and our place in the timeline of human civilization. As we continue to peel back the layers of Antarctica's secrets, who knows what other revelations await us beneath the ice? The implications of these discoveries are profound, challenging the narrative of human progress. Now, imagine for a moment a world where the history books are rewritten, 
where the timeline of human achievement is not a straight line but a vast web of interconnected points, each one a testament to the ingenuity and resilience of our ancestors. These discoveries in the icy wilderness of Antarctica suggest a world where our forebears possessed knowledge and capabilities that rival, and perhaps even surpass, our own. The Piri race map, for instance, hints at a time when ancient mariners navigated the globe with a precision that baffles modern scholars. What other marvels, we wonder, did these early explorers achieve? The meteorite ALH 84001, with its potential evidence of extraterrestrial life, calls into question our understanding of biology and the origins of life. It suggests that life is not a phenomenon unique to our pale blue dot, but a cosmic event scattered across the universe, like stardust. How does this recast our understanding of life? What does it mean for our place in the cosmos? These findings also challenge the methodologies and assumptions underlying contemporary scientific research. They invite us to question, to probe, to look beyond the accepted knowledge. The mysterious artifacts and maps discovered beneath the Antarctic ice, for example, suggest that our ancestors were far more advanced and globally connected than we previously thought. If this is true, then we must reassess the conventional wisdom that views progress as a linear forward march. In the face of these revelations we're urged to revisit the drawing board, to question the established theories and methodologies. To embrace the possibility that our understanding of the world is incomplete, and that the key to a more comprehensive knowledge lies in the unexplored corners of our planet, like Antarctica. These revelations not only compel a re-evaluation of human history but also challenge the methodologies and assumptions of contemporary scientific research. They remind us that the pursuit of knowledge is a journey, not a destination and that the mysteries of Antarctica are but one chapter in the grand saga of human curiosity and discovery. As we continue to explore and learn, we're not just uncovering the past, we're also shaping the future. As we delve deeper into the mysteries of Antarctica, we stand on the brink of potentially groundbreaking discoveries. Our journey through the unexplored frontier, the cartographic enigma, and the cosmic mystery has brought us here, to the precipice of a new understanding, a fresh perspective that could redefine everything we thought we knew about our world. Let's ponder over this for a moment. Antarctica, a place often thought of as a barren, lifeless wasteland, might just hold the answers to some of the greatest mysteries of our existence. It's a thought that is as exciting as it is daunting, but isn't that the very essence of exploration, of discovery? The thrill of the unknown, the allure of the concealed, the promise of the undiscovered. The Piri race map, the meteorite ALH 84001, and the recent findings that hint at advanced ancient civilizations, these are not mere isolated phenomena. They are interconnected pieces of a grand puzzle that spans across centuries and galaxies. Each piece, each discovery nudges us closer to a revelation that could potentially alter the course of human history and science. But it's not just about rewriting the history books or challenging the scientific status quo, it's about expanding our collective knowledge, about pushing the boundaries of human curiosity. Each step we take towards understanding the mysteries of Antarctica is a step towards understanding ourselves, our origins, and our place in the universe. In the grand scheme of things, we are but fleeting visitors on this cosmic stage, but that doesn't mean we can't leave our mark, that we can't contribute to the grand narrative of existence. Every question we ask, Every answer we seek is a testament to our indomitable spirit, our relentless pursuit of knowledge. As we venture further into the icy expanses of Antarctica, let's remember that exploration is not just about reaching new frontiers, it's about the journey, the quest for truth, the courage to question and the will to understand. It's about the audacity to dream, to imagine a world far beyond our current understanding and the resolve to make that dream a reality. So let's not see Antarctica as a barren wasteland. Let's see it for what it truly is, a treasure trove of hidden knowledge waiting to be uncovered. Let's continue the exploration, let's keep asking questions, let's keep seeking answers. For in the heart of the unknown lies the essence of discovery. The icy expanses of Antarctica are not a barren wasteland but a treasure trove of hidden knowledge waiting to be uncovered. It is up to us to continue the exploration and unravel the mysteries that lie beneath the ice.